project is actually a challenge. And for those of you who are familiar with or who watched the Aline um, show back in the 80s, 90s, and into the 2000s, um, we always once a week had a challenge where it was called Challenge Heidi. And that was when people would send their trash to me and then I would make something out of it and uh, then would show it on the show. And believe it or not, it was our most popular part of the show. So I do have on my Eco Heidi um, show here a Challenge Heidi segment, and that's what's coming up next. So this, this challenge came a few weeks back when we were either doing the pajama party or it was um, a cool to craft show where um, Andrea Curry said, what would you do? What do you do with the ends of the soda cans and the, the tops to the soda cans? And I don't know how many of you realize that I actually have a line of soda can jewelry. This is my little angel. And this is like my little um, flower. And we'll put that up. So I go through a lot of soda cans and I have a lot of, of lids and, and tops. So it was a perfect challenge for the first show. What I do is I cut off the, um, the tops and the bottoms with my um, bandsaw. And so when I have these left over, I think it's lots of fun to make art out of them. And that was the picture that you saw. So in order to do that, you have to kind of, when you cut it off, then you have to have just kind of, and I just brought my little, my little one today. until you get it where, the way you want it. And you can tell by this is, I really smash it. And also, um, let me reach over here. I do have a lid, and this is kind of funny because here's the, here's the lid with the little mouth. Well, on my next eco, this is gonna be a continuation on the, the challenge, Heidi, because I, I thought of a really cute project to do with this, and so I'll do that on my next eco, Heidi, and I'll tell you about the next shows. Um, when we're done here. So all you do with this is just use some of the um, alcohol ink. And what I just did was I just kind of very, really, really easy, just kind of poured them on just to colorize them. That one's not going to open. And just have fun with it. Add the different colors. And I just kept adding them until they got to the color that I wanted. And you can even take a, a, some, I didn't really pick some really bright colors. Let me get a brighter color in here. There's a nice color. Now I did notice, again, here's here's one of my designer secrets. I, I noticed sometimes that I can't get the color to stick. And that means that um, it's got maybe some oil on it. So, and also I put some alcohol, um, just regular rubbing alcohol into a spritzer and I spritz it. And this one looks like it's acting that way. So you just kind of have to spray on and get it to, um, to move around. Sometimes it just is stubborn, and I don't know why. I don't know if there if there's a difference between the inside and the outside. And then I kind of let that dry, and then I add to it. And let me show you here. Here's the um, one of them that's done. And then I just take a um, like a um, flat marble and glue it on. Now the fun thing with this project. And I was going to do a little bit more to it, but I just didn't get time to, to do it. Let me get these things out of the way. Is I put it onto a board that I, um, and again, the instructions we're going to, on this one are going to be on, um, well, I know they're going to be on my blog. I'm not sure if they're in the newsletter. But the cool thing about this is I got this board from a, um, let me show the back of it. A local tile store had some discontinued tile, so I took the tile off. It's a cool board. It's like masonite with a nice formica, and then I just spray painted it. So it makes for a really cool, and then it has this hole in it too that I can hang it from. So it makes a really cool art piece that you can put on your wall. 
So I really think that's a cool project. And then all kinds of little um, like tiles or uh, like I said, you could use some flat marbles, you could use buttons, anything um, that you have around the house.